Hello guys, welcome to Gaikoku Mama Kitchen, Thai Kitchen in Japan. I will show you how to cook simple Thai food, easy to prepare and delicious. So if we talk about Thai food, which Thai dish comes first in your mind? Tok tik tok is a tom yum rice. So today I'm not gonna show you how to make tom yum soup, but I gonna introduce you to tom yum fried rice. Yes, that's right. The Thai style fried rice with classic tom yum flavor. You're gonna love it. So let's start. There are three essential Thai herbs for tom yum, which is Raymond glass, Karangkao, Kaffir flam leaf. So we're gonna chop this uh, three uh, Thai herb in very small pieces to make uh, the tom yum paste. By the way, if you have a mortar at home, you can cut it in very, very like a small pieces. But I don't have at home. I gonna chop it. So I use the frozen uh, Raymond glass. Is have a little bit liquid. The garangkao, I also use the frozen garangkao, it has a little bit of liquid in there, so... Put them together, put the lamb leaf, so pull it out like this. Always smells so good. Roll it like this. <laughs> if you like spicy, you can add like a chili pepper like this. So I'm gonna add one in this time because I gonna cook for my husband lunch. Thank you. <laughs> and this is our dynasty curve for tom yum or we call tom yum dynasty. Another iconic ingredients in the tom yum is chili paste or chili yams so uh, in japan you can order it from amazon is this type of chili yam if you love thai food you should have this in your kitchen you can use this to cook thai food many dishes or you can dip it like a, a potato chip also good because it have like a salty and a little bit sweet net flavors so I recommend. So for tom yum fried rice, we're gonna mix the Thai chili paste with uh, nam pra fish sauce. And sugar. Uh, this is the organic coconut mm. sugar. Mm. The tom yum paste is quite sticky, so you mix them up until the tom yum place like a become a liquid like this. That is enough. So we got also gonna yeah. add the onion in our fried rice to chop it in cube shape. Yes, of course, we are gonna cook fried rice. Tomato is used in fried rice, very common in Thailand. So for tomato, you should remove 
seat because uh, the seat has a uh, liquid, so it can make your fry like become like a salt, salty. And of course, we gonna cook a uh, fried rice. Rice for fried rice, I recommend you to use the very dry rice that the grain is separated, <laughs> so it will not make your uh, fried rice become like a soggy. So this is the ingredients for uh, tom yum fried rice and also fries. Hello. This is my little girl. <laughs> she gonna join us again. Yeah, she gonna join us. Right? You gonna help mommy? Amy gonna help mommy? Ah. Ah. Today we gonna cook tom yum fried rice. Let's do it. Ah. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Let's get to your... Two tablespoon of oils. She baby and after that we gonna put a herb. smell aroma from it. Daddy, mm -hmm. can you take the... Hey, you! Now we can smell aroma from the herb. Next, we gonna add the uh, onion. It smells so good. Cook the onion until it become like a transparent. Another thing that's never forget for fried rice is egg. You should put egg in fried rice like this. So cook it. Wait until the egg set. is the shrimp or you can put uh, the other protein like uh, chicken or tofu whatever you like so today I use shrimp fry the shrimp until it's like a uh, change the color a little bit after that you can throw in the rice because you don't want your train to become overcooked. So you can slow rice. Wow. And after rice is put our chili creams mix with uh, fish salt and sugar mm -hmm. and toast. toast the rice and everything properly make sure that your chili paste cover every single rice grain <laughs> And now I gonna throw in tomato. Oh. 
approach is around and my hair is become a little bit dry. It feels so good. Now everything is set and rice grain is covered with the toothpaste. So we're gonna turn off the heat and add some brown juice. Make sure that you turn off the heat because if you add the brown juice while you heating up the round gonna turn to bitter taste gonna spoil all your fried rice Let's mix this up once again in the pit like this We usually cherry serve the fried rice with cucumber slice, steamed onion, and piece a piece of lamb. So, like this. How is this? Amazing! Wow! That's good. Yeah.